if c square theta plus tan square theta is 3 by 1 by 2, then cos theta plus sin theta is equal to. Here, this is cos theta and this cos theta has relation with sec theta, which means we have to replace this tan square theta in order to find this relation. So, here tan square theta we can replace it with sec square theta minus 1 because sec square theta minus tan square theta is 1. Now, this is sec square theta plus tan square theta. Tan square theta is sec square theta minus 1 which is equal to 3 into 6 plus 1 7 by 2. Now, you can see 2 sec square theta. 2 sec square theta is equal to 7 by 2 plus 1. That is equal to 9 by 2. 7 plus 2 is 9. So, 9 by 2. Now, sec square theta is equal to 9 by 4. So, sec theta is equal to root of 9 by 4 which is equal to 3 by 2. Now, if sec theta is 3 by 2, then cos theta is equal to 1 by sec theta which is equal to 2 by 3. If cos theta is 2 by 3, then sin theta is equal to, actually you can write it 2 plus 3 is 5. So, root 5 by 3. Or you can find sin theta by sin square theta plus cos square theta is equal to 1. So, 1 minus 4 by 9, which is equal to root of 1 minus 4 by 9, which is equal to root 5 by 3. Now, cos theta is 2 by 3 and sin theta is root 5 by 3 which is equal to 2 plus root 5 by 3. So, option 2 is your answer.